What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing something different. Today we're actually going to be doing some survival in Minecraft on a server. So, all the stuff I have got before. Um, no clue where the hell I am right now. This thing is broken. Alright, since that's not working, you know what we're going to be doing. It still can be safe. So I have been doing some stuff AFK. little four things over there. I made a couple contraptions. I actually changed something in there. You know how it used to be glass? Let's just... Oh, crud. I forgot to use the contraption. There. Got no, no food source real quick. Oh my god, I suck flying. You guys like this texture pack, yes or no? I wonder. Because I seem to enjoy it. Plus it does fix lag issues. Oops. Alright, I screwed that one up. There we go. Perfect. Replace that off. Boom. Okay. So now we're in the top layer. So basically I made this contraption so I can just, so I press this button and it'll shoot me off. And what I mean by shoot me off, I mean like I ha I'll have my elytra equipped so I can go like all the way down there super fast. Alright, what I mean by I change the glass, like this place is still normal, but as you guys can probably tell, is that there is a wood instead of glass here. So, uh, I did all this glass off camera because it just took me a long time. And I didn't think you guys wanted to see it. In the meantime, when I also extended the thing, I also made a throne. With the spare stuff that I don't need. I have also changed... Actually, I didn't change anything there. I added wood here as well. And as you can probably guess already, there is more wood down here. It does look pretty good. With this texture pack, it just makes oak wood just look so beautiful. Um, let me know if you guys agree on this texture pack. Like I said, um, just don't even push me on the bees or the villages. So basically, you remember how I had so many villages down there? Um, for a farm? So I pretty much took them out. I started breeding like crazy in this place, which then I transformed into a market. And I basically used a boat to transfer villages into here. And then I found some bees in the wild because I didn't want to get some from my nest over there. So they pretty much pollinate some uh, the seeds in there, which makes it faster to grow, which is really nice. So basically, I've made this entire thing off camera because it took me a really long time. I tried recording it. Um, the it did take me a long time. I was going to do it in parts, but then uh, the recording got corrupted, so which was a real shame. So basically, like I was actually looking forward to uploading this, but basically, I did professions. Like it doesn't seem to be working because I did professions like pretty much. So basically, this is the this should normally be like librarians and stuff, but since there's more profession stuff upstairs and um, they change occasionally. Still fine. Uh, one of these guys have mending somewhere. Um, yeah, but basically this is a librarian group. I made a little throne for this cat so you can keep an eye on them. Yes, I did take inspiration from PewDiePie because of that. Yes, I added another 
um, villager row, I added some more stuff here. I know you guys have been seeing me go in here sometimes in recordings, but I haven't really explained, so I thought I might as well explain. So yeah, so these should be blacksmiths, but then again, they tend to change. These should be fletchers and stuff. Now this area, none of you have seen because I newly added it, so basically this is the villager breeder here now. So I pretty much just, whenever I need a new villager, I just pretty much breed. So I just don't let them breed by themselves, like, so I just wait, like, I'd go, like, downstairs all the way, and eventually, like, in, like, ten minutes, I'll, like, I'll, well, I'll pretty much give them food first, so I'll wait, like, ten minutes downstairs here, and, um, then I'll go back upstairs and I'll find a baby villager, which I'll then transfer to over here to be another farmer. Not gonna go in there because there's a lot of lag due to how many villages and then bees we have in there. But yeah, I thought I would explain what was going on there. So basically, my idea on this episode was to make a beautiful contraption to harvest the bamboo over there. So we're gonna need sticky pistons. Oh yeah, I also put stairs on the beacon over here looks a little bit easier, uh, well, not easier, but it looks nicer, to, and it's also easier to get up there. No clue why I want to get up there, but just, who knows? Might do something in the future with it. Uh, now, if I do remember my end chest, I put it all the way down on the bottom floor. There we go. Okay, so we should have, no we don't. This stuff I duplicated using the machine that I made. It does work. It just takes a while. So I tend to do it off camera. So I think I put my sticky pistons away in one of these chests or something. Um, I got all this wood from chopping down. Then, like, I got a stack and I started duplicating. I used it to, like, change pretty much everything here. Uh... Anything there, anything there, anything there. Some wheat. Uh, nether stuff that I use for the nether base. Seeds. No, um. Oh my god. Can we not find them? Okay, so they're not here, okay. Now I'm just gonna. Uh, we'll be back when I find them. And we are back. I have found them. They were all the way at nearly the top of the tower. So, yeah. Alright, let's head over to the Pandora River. Um, oh, yeah. I also have planned something for next episode that we do in this series. I'm not going to show it yet. It's still not ready. I've been doing this off camera. Okay. So, the reason we have sticky pistons is because I was going to gather some dirt here and I was going to use it to push the bamboo. Because I don't know if normal pistons would work, so I just went for the safe route. Let's get around. Perfect. 16 blocks. Okay, nice. Give me OCD right there. Instead, I'm just gonna. Perfect, okay. Alright, so. Actually, no, we're gonna actually need that. Oops. I. Did not think this through. Really didn't. So, I'm gonna need to. Yeah, okay. So, I'm actually gonna need more dirt than 16. Because the sticky piston's going to be here, and then I'm going to have to put a block attached to it. Let's just go that far. Okay, that seems reasonable enough. I do have repeaters, just in case. Alright, so... We then get the sticky pistons.
All right, so I'm gonna have to take those off. Perfect. Okay. So is now can oops. Okay, left them dead there. So now those can hopefully without any repeaters. I brought the repeaters just in case because I wasn't too sure. So I guess we're gonna find out. Get the lever. Alright, okay, so it does activate perfect. Wait, does it go all the way? That that was the that was actually the real question. Oh, we can't reach the last one. That's kinda bad. Can we do something with the redstone repeaters? Because that doesn't work, okay. Bring the lever back. Um, dirt can go here as well, so I can get redstone, and I get the lever. Oh, but it doesn't activate that one. Okay, hold up. I I got an idea. I got an idea. I can make this work. This is fine. I just got to extend it wall one more. So then I put a that there. Okay. And I'll put the redstone there, so yep, that works. Just, you know what, let's just add a second one just in case. Can't be too sure. Put the lever here, get the redstone back, and attach it. And now if I am correct, oh, okay, so we've made it, okay, hold up. I have to get rid of that. I put the redstone. Oops, I missed. Lever. Come on. Oh, come on. It's really upsetting. Why does this thing not project any further? Um. Hmm. I think we got a problem on our hands. Well, let's see if I can do something complicated here. Actually, might need more repeaters. I don't want to go there. So instead of going there, I'll go there. Let's go. No, that's even. That's even worse. Okay. Um, this is bad. This is really bad. Actually, maybe we can just do something like this, and we'll just attach a red center. Yeah, that might work. That might work. Just yeah, I think it is. And let's find this out because I'm really not 100% sure. So we do that, and I'll go. Wait. One like that, 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 one like that. And if you're wondering why I'm doing like that, so I can do that, and then I can go like that. So it makes a little loop. Oops. Okay. So it makes a loop around, so it connects, so it extends all the way, hopefully. Yes, it does. Let's go. Just gonna do that just in case. It does look messy. I will fix it up off camera. Got a problem now. Oh, dear God. Don't need it there, 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 there. Oops. I then screwed up. Okay, so if I am now corrected myself. Perfect! Okay, so we fixed our problem. If you are following this, uh, this is really not a tutorial because I would be doing it slower. I'm just making a contraption. If you want this to be a tutorial, let me know down in the comments. So I can do it. Now that I've figured it out. So, 
I can go as long as I want, pretty much. I just don't have enough redstone repeaters, because I can't really be bothered. And plus, I don't have enough redstone, because I really can't be bothered right now duplicating. Because I'd rather be doing some more stuff that's actually entertaining for you guys. It works. Okay. We're actually going to probably have to get slime blocks instead of the dirt. And then we attach a chest onto that with a hopper so it doesn't make a massive mess. That might work. Yeah, we actually got a lot of bamboo for that. It's really, really easy to make actually as well. Just... I'm not, I'm no redstone expert, but when you put a really dumb idea with another dumb idea, it works sometimes. Don't do this in real life, okay? Only do this in video games, okay? It just, trust me, don't do it in real life. It does not work, okay? Trust me, I, I know this from experience. I am 100% a certified um dumb person that has no clue what they're doing with their life currently we better have slime for the mob drops come on slime slime let's go do we have any more slime Just yeah we do good orange that should be enough slime really need to make some more crafting tables for like each section of the building. Lanagon, you guys did not come here for that. Oops. Um, I only ha I had to get hoppers as well, so iron. Give me that wood. So make a chest, 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 chest. Okay, that's definitely still not enough. Hold it, where's the actual wood? There we go. Chest everything up right here, boom, perfect. Really have enough wood to last us for ages. Oh great, we ran out of iron. Let's go up to get more iron. Hopefully it's smelted, not all. Because that's gonna be a real pain if we have to smelt it. We have five here. We'll bend this one. It's quartz. We ran out of iron. Unbelievable. Um, actually, no, no. I forgot where I've. I just realized where I've been storing all my iron. I'm pretty sure you guys, if you guys have been watching from like near the start, I guess you guys will know as well what's happened here because we have auto smelters. So yeah. Only a couple people understand what the hell happened. If you guys want to see me make that on for a tutorial, I can do that. Like, just le let me know. Any tutorial, I can probably do it. Even if I can't do it, I'll find out a way, to be honest. Because I really need to help out the community. Because the community sometimes need to learn how to do things and sometimes they can't learn by themselves which is okay because some people need help to do this, this stuff like to be honest like you're really not that so i'm actually offering you guys some help just let me know i'm really doesn't that bother me i'd, I'd rather dedicate my time to your guy to you guys I'm not doing this actually for money, I'm actually doing this for entertainment and to help people. Because every single dollar, once I get monetized, I'm going to be sending to charity for cancer. Because cancer is a real problem in the world, and so many people do not, like, pay, like doctors, like, they don't know how to cure this thing. So... 
yeah. I really want to help them, like, because I feel bad, like, to see people suffer. It's just not good, like. And later on, like, we can also do other organizations and stuff. Or Let me know what other charity... Well, oops, what did I do there? Okay, but let me know what other charities I should um, donate my money to that I make from videos to. Because I really, like, people, like, really need help out in the world. And they aren't getting that attention, you know what I mean? So, like, I'm here trying to help, if you guys know what I mean. Oh, wait, what the hell happened here? Ooh. Oh, I realize what's happened. Okay. Alright, as I was saying, though, still, like, people with cancer, like, it's a huge problem in the world. Like, no one knows a cure, no one knows how to fix it. Like, so far, all we got is chemo, I'm pretty sure. No clue, because some of my grandparents actually have it. And I'm not just doing this for them. I, I'm actually doing it for the rest of the people that suffer with this deadly disease. Because it is not a nice thing to be dealing with. Like, you don't need to suffer. And I reckon if we, like, raise enough money for this, I reckon we can find out a cure. And if we do find a cure, pretty much cancer can be stopped at all costs and if you ever get cancer you'll be cured without knowing that you have a chance of dying or losing somebody else's life because there wasn't anything and like then you're gonna feel bad about it even though it wasn't your fault So let's test this real quick. If I can get this out of hand, there we go. Oh no. You know what? I don't think we can do a automated system like how I'm trying to do it. I think it's a little bit too advanced. And because it keeps on getting stuck together. So, we're going to have to remove that with all the chests and everything. I will find out a way. Once I do find out a way, I will um, upload another video on this. Or, if you guys want a tutorial, I will do it in the tutorial if I find out a way. Whenever I find out a way, once I find out a way, I'll upload it. So, instead, we're just going to... demolish all those. I really, I'm trying to set up a live stream and so you guys can actually donate and every single, like how much money we get, for the amount of money that we get all goes to cancer research. So none of it goes to me at all. Every single live stream that we do is going to go to an organization to help people. We need one more dead block. Because just people are just suffering out there, like, with nobody, like, knowing what to do or help them. Like, it's like, no cure or anything, so they're going to be panicking. And f their relatives are going to be panicking as well. So I reckon it would be better if the world knows a cure about it. Because if a cure has, um... Like, if we find out a cure for cancer, that's a lot of lives that we have saved right there. And not just me am I just saving it. Other people that also donate, that's, like, also really good. Like, because you don't have to donate to me. You can also donate to uh, cancer if you don't trust me. Like, that's completely fine. It's just... 
on like whenever I do a live stream, there's going to be a um a link in the description for and like to donate to me. So for cancer, and there'll also be a link in the description if you don't trust me. Just in case, you can go do a um cancer organization. You can just donate to them directly if you'd rather do that, which is completely fine. Reason I'm doing this right here is because I'm just gonna have these here, so I'm just gonna like. I'm gonna actually have to get some more dirt. So I'm gonna make it like a dirt little staircase up there. So I can just drop off all the bamboo. Actually, I just figured out a way how we can just collect it all. We're just gonna need a minecart with a hopper inside of it. So we just go up and down, up and down with the rail. So it goes. Alright, but that's gonna be it for this episode.